Hey guys, this is the Alpha DI. Just a quick tutorial on the features on this thing. Right here, you got your input. You got your pad, which spent a lot of time on the pad, making sure it's transparent. You got your through, which goes out to your amp, which is a direct uh, malt of the input. Your gain pot with a lot of juice in it, so you can overdrive the gain stages if you need to. Uh, two three-way switches right here. The first one up is bright, flat, and a mid-grind, which is awesome to add some poke through a mix. And then you've got the, the right side over there, or the left side, the way you're looking at it, and you've got the dark setting, which boosts the low end, cuts the top end, sort of like a Motown bass sound. Your flat position and your really nice bass boost. Um, the flexibility of those EQ points are incredible on this thing. If you flip it around on the back, you've got a minus 10 plus 4, which to me is the most amazing part of it. Taking down the level of the XLR output so you can drive your external mic pre. You got a quarter inch high impedance output. You can feed another amp that's colored from the front or a guitar pedal, or you can use this thing as a bass amp and it sounds sick. You've got all the EQ points and the gain and your tube stages coming out of that little baby into a power amp or an effects return. And there you go, there's your, there's your bass sound. And you've got your ground lift, which you know normal people have. And then you have your, your power. Two tubes, what else do you need? You need a little less gain? Actually, you can swap that out for a 12 AT7. Bob's your uncle, this thing kicks ass. This is one of my favorite sounds on the Alpha DI. I'm just kicking in the deep switch.